Welcome to another tutorial on Palo Alto Fibre. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can configure Palo Alto Fibre to send the logs to an external syslog server via SSL session, which is going to be a secure session. And in my case, this is log server is configured on PFSense Fibre, and you can refer to the video on your screen to complete the syslog ng services configuration on, on pfsense firewall. Moving back to our Palo Alto firewall, let's try to configure the device to forward the logs to the syslog server or SSL session. So the first step is to create the syslog profile. So let's try to create one. So go to device, syslog, click on add and create the profile. Syslog services are running on WAN interface with an IP Protocol is going to be SSL and port is going to be 5140 as per the configuration. I am selecting the format as IETA, which is the RFC standard. And you can select the facility as per your requirement. For more information regarding the facility, you can search for the syslog facility to get to know more about what types of what type of facility you should be selecting here. Now we will create the log forwarding profile. Click on objects and then click on log forwarding. Click on add. 
name it. I am specifically going to add the profile that we have created for syslog. Now we will try to configure the policy to forward the traffic to an external syslog. As you can see, under the actions, um, selecting the profile that I've created, log forwarding profile. And inside the device certificates, I have the root and the server certificate. Use in our case, imported already. So this is the certificate authority cert. This is the certificate for the PF census log services. And this is for the Palo Alto firewall cert. So if you see here, I have specifically mentioned this certificate is for the secure syslog. And you can do that by checking this particular option, set certificate for secure syslog, click OK. So I have two certificate, one for the Palo Alto firewall, client cert, this is the PFSense cert for syslog services on PFSense, and this is the root CA cert used for signing these two cert. So I have imported them on all the devices and the server. Now let's try to commit the configuration. Configuration is committed. Now let's try to check the logs on the syslog server.
there's one more thing that we have missed here which is the lock setting under devices so we are going to uh, configure for system for configuration and then we'll try to commit the changes Now let's try to check the status. As you can see on my screen, there is the logs on the server and you can check the source ip which is the palo alto management ip sending the traffic and you can check the same on gui as well So this is the GUI of PFSense where the services are running. So these are the logs from today's uh, events regarding the system, regarding the policy information from the Palo Alto Firewall. That's all in this video. See you in the next video and please do not forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the like button. Stay safe. See you next time.